Road to GH will reveal that after Heather is officially released from prison, the entire town of Port Charles falls into a state of high anxiety and tension. For years, Heather has been a name that instills fear in many due to her string of brutal crimes. Although medical experts have confirmed that Heather's murderous behaviors may have stemmed from cobalt poisoning, a substance that can affect the nervous system, causing delusions and uncontrollable behaviors, few people believe this is a valid reason to forgive her. In reality, many doubt whether Heather has genuinely changed or if she's merely taking advantage of the opportunity to reoffend. Stephen, Heather's son, has returned to Port Charles to reunite and take his mother away from town. Heather is thrilled by her son's return, feeling as if she finally has a family to rely on after her dark days in prison. However, behind the joy of reunion, Heather harbors another secret ambition. Deep down, she dreams of taking Ace, her grandson whom she has never had a real chance to care for, away from Port Charles to start a new life. Heather always sees Ace as an inseparable part of her bloodline and believes her life will be more complete with the little boy by her side. This ambition worries many people, especially those who know Heather's past well. They fear that Ace's presence in Heather's life will not only bring trouble for him, but also pose a potential threat to everyone around them. Despite this, Heather quietly nurtures this intention, viewing it as her last hope to rebuild her darkened life, with the belief that Ace will bring her a new chance to show genuine repentance and love. Since Esme's death, Heather has constantly worried about Ace's future. She has always considered her grandson as a precious part of her family, and now that she is out of prison, she is determined to fill the void Esme left by personally caring for Ace. To Heather, this is not merely a simple desire, but a personal mission to atone for past mistakes. However, this ambition has led Heather back down a dark path once more. She is unafraid to use any means, including schemes and covert tactics, to ensure that Ace belongs to her. Heather has unexpectedly approached Alexis with a chilling request, custody of Ace. Heather's resolute and demanding gaze immediately fills Alexis with intense worry. Heather's appearance at her home was already a surprise, but her demand for custody of the child leaves Alexis both shocked and frightened. She is well aware of Heather's dark past, a woman with extreme and mentally unstable behaviors with unpredictable motives that no one can control. In Alexis's mind, the thought of entrusting Ace to Heather is a catastrophe. She cannot imagine a safe future for the child under the influence of someone like Heather, a person unhesitant to resort to manipulative tactics to get her way. Alexis understands that Heather lacks not only the capability to care for and raise Ace properly, but also poses many risks that could drag the child into a spiral of dark schemes and dangerous actions. Heather's determination is evident in her gaze and words, and Alexis quickly realizes that Heather is willing to go to any lengths to gain custody of Ace. While Heather speaks lovingly about caring for her grandson, Alexis knows that this is merely a facade concealing much deeper intentions. Facing this tense situation, Alexis decides she must stand up to protect Ace, even if it means confronting Heather and the schemes she may devise. For her, safeguarding Ace's future from Heather's possessiveness is an unavoidable duty, as it is the only way to keep the child safe in a healthy environment, away from the darkness Heather might bring. Alexis understands that the custody request is only the beginning of Heather's plan. Deep down, she feels the frightening intentions behind Heather's actions. If she doesn't achieve her goal legally, Heather will not hesitate to resort to the darkest methods to seize Ace. From the haunting look in Heather's eyes and her resolute tone, Alexis knows this is no idle threat. Heather is prepared to do whatever it takes, even unlawful acts, to have the child with her. This thought sends a shiver down Alexis's spine. She knows Heather is someone who will cross all moral boundaries, even resorting to violence or manipulation to achieve her desires. Alexis senses lurking danger and understands that Heather's focus on Ace cannot be taken lightly. She could secretly watch, plan an abduction, or even threaten those around her to pressure Alexis. In the past, Alexis had believed in Heather's ability to change and supported her release, thinking that everyone deserves a second chance. But now, after witnessing Heather's determined attitude and dark intentions toward Ace, 
Alexis realizes that decision was truly a mistake. She understands that not only is Ace in danger, but she herself may also face threats from someone like Heather, who will do anything to get what she wants. The situation becomes more tense than ever, and Alexis knows she cannot stand idly by. With a strong instinct to protect Ace, Alexis begins making plans to ensure the child's safety. She considers increasing security around her home, possibly even seeking legal measures to limit Heather's access to Ace. At the same time, Alexis understands that Heather may not easily give up and may resort to more terrifying actions if she feels obstructed. Will Alexis succeed in protecting Ace and avoid Heather's revenge, or will Heather find a way to execute her dark plans? Stay tuned for upcoming episodes to explore the bold decisions Alexis will make and the intense battle between these two women for Ace's safety.